Good morning, everyone. So we're about to head out of town and go to Rockingham. I'm super excited for this event. I uh, just got the car loaded up. Everything is like jam packed in this car. Didn't think it was possible. I got a tent in here and everything, um, but we are perfect weather. I mean, we're just ready for this event. So literally have parts, chair, tent, tools, uh, tires in the back. Um, everything is literally crammed back here. So we're gonna go and hit the road. Uh, got about a three hour drive. Um, and I think we're gonna go check into our hotel first and then go, I don't know. But let's go ahead and kick this event off. The check-in is at four. Um, our gate's open for racers at four. Tech isn't open till 5.30. And then I think we start the roll racing at either six or seven, I believe it's seven. So uh, yeah, driver's meetings at 6.30 and then seven, that's right. So we're gonna hit the road and we will get back with y'all once we get there. stopping to get some fuel and some drinks but so far so good I think we got a about an hour in of driving and hopefully everything seems good we get there safely and uh, on time we're tracking pretty good should be there um, to the hotel at least uh, probably about three o'clock and we should be good prep down on the track i'm gonna do some tests and tune for about an hour and a half i'm gonna watch a couple of these races and then i'll uh i'll probably make a hit hit or two if i can just to see the starting line's actually at these flags and cones they had to move it up from the tree um so it's gonna be a little bit off on mile per hour but um plan is 130 class tonight for roll racing and then 12 0 index tomorrow so they're just gonna finish up some prep and i'll get some videos of uh so there's some pretty sweet cars here so pretty excited to show you guys this
Alright, so test and tune's over. Made a hit, it was good. Now we're gonna hop into the 130 class for the roll racing and go straight to eliminations. There's a bunch of cars in here, so it's until they get down to a handful, they aren't gonna do any, uh, it's just whoever you go up against. So hopefully they're gonna get the same one too fast and try to like hit the brakes on me, but we'll give it a shot and see what happens. Let's get it. So literally just won the first round, but now we gotta go straight into a second round elimination. So cars not even have a chance to cool off. There's not a lot of people here, so round two. Got him. And the right lane goes 126. Brant Morris, Bryant Morris turning on the wind line. Left lane slow roller. 60 miles an hour from Brendan Logsdon. Steve Schrader, the left lane, out of Gastonia, North Carolina. Here we go. And that's that MG. Wild little hot rod with the Coyote motor under the hood. All right, 
Uh, so uh, we got some information saying that something might have come off that car in the right lane at about the thousand foot. So we're going to run down and check that out. I lost something, man. What did I lose? It said I lost something on the thousand foot mark. I don't know. I what love it a, a car with full exhaust all the way out the back over here in the right lane with the Nova. Engine lights on. I don't know what that's about. The car's running literally fine. Hey, they said I lost something at the thousand foot mark. Yeah, I heard that. I don't know what it could be. My engine light came on. Off the hood. Did I lose a... Oh, is it the... Uh, Bypass valve? Maybe? Nothing seems wrong. Pressure's good. let out again. He's going fourth round. I'm out, so I'm just going to help him, uh, I guess, record for him. And hopefully he wins. He's going to be against a uh, green Hellcat. So, still in the 130 class, but should be good. We in the finals. Brian actually made it against this, uh, got it against this Nova for the final, for the 130 class. Doing really good. Uh, it's getting a little spicy. Tracks a little uh, slippery in left lane. So um, Brian's gonna be, I believe, in. Are you in the left lane or right lane? Brian. Left lane. Okay. Yeah. Just can't spin. It's been really close. This uh, Nova's super sleeping. Uh, I personally think he's sandbagging, but it's too close to tell. So we'll see. Either way, pretty uh, pretty good payout. So 500 bucks. I mean, nothing crazy, obviously, but still, be pretty good. So we'll let some testing tune runs go, and then uh, do against the final.
right guy. Goes 128, left lane goes 132.09 of the Supra. You ready? All right. Coming around the tower. Coming around the tower. Coming around the tower. Coming around the tower. Coming around the said the Nova jump, they're going to rerun it. Oh. Yep. He, he is sandbagging. He just announced it. I knew it. Let's go. There's a 150 final. Got it. Got it. Okay. Keep thinking there's a final, it's not the final.
mile an hour? 138 to 141.